So each toe is going to be held separately and you're going to be doing a tippy tap motion for beginners. I, I'm able to just run it over. But okay. because you guys are beginners, you are going to be doing tippy tap motions. What you're aiming for in the finished nail is when the dog is standing up, her nails are good, um, it's a straight up and down look on them. So when you do them, you're going to... I tend to, when I'm home, have a, have a sand fan blowing this way, keeping the dust out, out of the dog's face. Uh, um, if, if I don't have one available, if I'm grooming in the nursing home, then I, I blow on the foot to, <laughs> to, to try to direct the, the dust away from the dog's Room face. in the nursing home? I can I, I watch. <laughs> for, for those who, who don't know how to do this, oh, I, I'm I holding it. each toe separately, and I'm going to support the Dremel with my thumb. Because if I just do this, it's, it's going to move around too much. So I'm supporting it. And then moving the Dremel with my fingers. There are numerous models of Dremels. This is just what I have. And that's just and, I, and I'm get, going straight on to, to the toe. A little tippy top motion. Oh yeah, okay. You can't see her quick. But see, see how, how this nail is coming out this way? Uh -huh. You're taking off the tip going this way, not this way. Yes, we're coming so just straight on. So the, basically, the, yeah, basically okay. the sharp part, really. Yeah. What see I call see it. How, how this nail angles downwards yeah, this way? Yeah. You're not putting the Dremel on this way. Okay. You're going this way, straight on. Straight no. on, okay. And little motions. <laughs> it smells like the epidemic. It does. It smells like the her nails are good. Her nails are in good shape. 